my Miami Angel night. Yeah. What's going on, my twins? Twins. What's going on, baby? What's popping in the life of a Gemini between mid month August? What's going on? Y'all in the meditative state? Y'all moving away from people? Thinking about it? Maybe? Hmm. You better choose you and get you right. This is for my sun, moon, rising, Venus, as well as the cross watchers for the sign of Gemini. This is not a personal. It is a general. Okay. So if you need a personal, hit me up. I do have those sales for $40 for 30 minutes. Okay. As well as $15 off for my 45 minute to an hour session. All right. So get that. Get Save y'all some money. Come pour this tea with me. I'm 100% available. I don't allow myself to get booked up. You know, I'm just like Gemini, but Gemini Venus, we strategic. Okay, so <laughs> we rocking. Um, y'all, thank you so much for the new subscribes. Thank you so much for the likes, the shares, the comments. Thank you so much for all of that, y'all. I love you guys. I love you so much back, all right? I may don't have time to comment on everybody's comment, but I do read all of my comments as well as I do send y'all much love and like, even those who going through tough sick circumstances i may can't come in every single thing i feel but baby i'm i promise you i'm radiating my light out your way okay babes so we rocking all right thank you welcome to the family y'all because we don't fuss we don't judge we grow we evolve okay we uplift one another we share and we just one happy big dysfunctional last family yes we is i'm gonna continue to grow thank y'all so much for holding me down and being there and being a supportive cast to my journey as well and allowing me to radiate my light towards you guys thank you so much yes if you're wondering why mocha had the titties out because i felt like wonder woman and right now i feel like fixing my titties because it's really going down right now so you know i'm from the south i have no shame so we don't do that okay so <clears throat> we rock it Right, so the first message that I have for you guys uh, comes from the Doreen Virtue Crystal Angels Oracle Card deck. Okay, I have Diamond. Scorpio got this too. Y'all may be dealing with Scorpio. Value your self worth. You're God's precious gem. Diamonds are a wonderful symbol of how beautiful, how being under pressure can lead to beauty. After all, diamonds are formed by pressure on the carbon element that composes them. Perhaps you've been under certain strain recently or in an insignificant period of your life. All the stress or trauma that you've endured has made you who you are. This card comes to you as a reminder that you are God's precious diamond. Although you've been through a lot, God's strength has always supported you and always will. Now it's time for you to recognize just how valuable you are. Just as you would only choose diamonds that are minded in a humane fair trade way, so too do you want to treat yourself with kindness and fairness. This may mean developing an assertive style of communication where you show yourself respect and teach others to respect you too. Put some respect on my name, okay? So, Gemini, during this time, you're having to stand your ground. I do see between the 16th and the 31st, a lot of y'all are going to be balancing, realigning yourself, finding your center. Some of y'all could be dealing with a Pisces as well. Some of y'all are going to be finding your center, finding your chi, okay? Some of y'all are definitely working on, during this time, aligning your chakras, okay? I do see that um, some of y'all third eyes literally pouring information. Y'all get downloads left and right, okay? Some of y'all are trying to balance yourselves, okay, during this time. Some some of y'all are going through downloads as well as going in and out of past life. A lot of y'all during this time will be fading in and out of your past life. Fear does not want you to be afraid, okay? Y'all are mutable energies. You're transmutable. So with that said, you do have the ability to jump from dimension to dimension to dimension to heal situations, to transmute negative situations into positive situations, okay? Or into positive outcomes. You help the universe with... Uh, Clearing all the negative energy. So if you've been kind of cutting away negative energy in your life, you, you're literally living your purpose by doing so. Make these motherfuckers put some respect on it. Watch how you handle me. Okay. All right. So I do see a lot of y'all are learning something during this time. Some of y'all are going back to school. Some of y'all are getting into the mysteries, getting into the arts. Okay. Some of y'all are also, um, yeah, what, with, the, with that transmuting, it wants me to go back away. <clears throat> With this transmuting, it's up to you, Gemini, to stay centered. You have to stay centered to have control over the over the dimensional shift. Some of y'all, you're in a in a place of fear because you're going through transmuting and you're going you're learning how to astral travel. And some of y'all don't have to be asleep, but some of y'all, your past life and this life is kind of flashing back and forth before your eyes between during this time okay i do see a lot of y'all are sages okay so because you are saved because you are a sage all right 
a lot of y'all soul, you're going through soul remembrance, okay? So you're having to remember, Gemini, you still live here on earth among us, okay? So watch what you're saying because I do feel that a lot of y'all are going through opening your heart chakra as well as well as your solar plexus. During this time, a lot of you are learning how to use emotion over intellect, okay? You don't have to think every damn situation. Every situation is not a strategic situation, okay? And a lot of y'all are learning how to love again. A lot of y'all are falling in love with yourself during this time, okay? But it comes with that centeredness. You're needing to be centered, okay? During this time, with the downloads that you're going to receive, some of y'all, it may scare the hell out of you. You may have issues with sleeping or communicating the things that you're seeing if you're dealing with someone else who is who is spiritual or they're working on um they're going through an awakening and they're going through some form of um an awakening okay i feel like some of y'all are also dealing with transmutables some of y'all are dealing with pisces sagittarius virgo okay people who are dealing with this sign a lot of y'all had it was destined for you two to meet okay because this person is going to help ground you okay whoever whomever is in your life life they're helping ground you i feel like some of y'all feel like this person is working against you some of y'all some of y'all feel like somebody put magic on you okay gemini you're going through a shift in your emotions, and it's going to affect your intellect. You're needing to know when to cut what on and when to cut that shit off, okay? Because you cannot handle everything in life as far as strategic because you're going to miss something. You're only going to be able to see the situation for black and white instead of a spectrum. Your energy is that of dualistic, okay? Duality. So that said, you have to see things from different spectrums, okay? It's naturally who you are. You may have perceived the situation wrong. A lot of y'all are going to be finding that out during this time. <clears throat> Some of y'all are... Healing from some sort of family situation, okay, possibly with an earth sign. Some of y'all are falling back and working on just healing yourself at this time. Uh, some of y'all will uh, be moving away from an air sign. I feel like this person, you have to see it from a different perspective. Some of y'all are dealing with an air sign that has major depression and major anxiety. I feel like some of y'all are giving up. you just like, you know what, I'm trying to grow. I have to move away from this because I ultimately want a family with this person, but this person has deep emotional issues to heal from as well as traumas. And for some of y'all, y'all are going to be moving towards someone who's dealing with depression or anxiety this month to help out, okay? <clears throat> some of y'all are in contemplation if someone um, put you in a third party situation or not I do feel like some of y'all who are dealing with air signs now this person is needing help and you're needing to transmute a, 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 transmute a negative situation into a positive one here in the 3D and some of y'all are having a hard time doing so you just like to hell with it I don't want to deal with that no F that person to be honest with you you have to even out the karmic skills okay because in the past life you may see this person doing something for you okay or you may see that you had an opportunity to help someone before in the past life due to a broken heart and you didn't choose your light side of you. Okay? That's what somebody spirit says. Um, spirit, please send me the message for them now between the 16th and the 31st of August. Show me. Yeah, some of y'all are being, some of y'all have a fire sign. Gem, I mean, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, that you feel like is being very defensive towards you. Um, this person is not giving you that new start that you want. For some of y'all, this person. This this person wants a new start, but I feel like it definitely has to, has to do with a three party situation. Okay, this person who put this person who put y'all in a third party situation, especially if it's a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This was infinite. You have to grow from this. Some of y'all have. <clears throat> excuse me, deep-rooted rejection issues, and you, you had to go through this, okay, because you're having to choose yourself. If you separated from this person, no worries, they're going to be back, okay, but you had to remove yourself from the situation in order to choose yourself, your self-worth, your self-value, okay? Um, I do see that something new will be beginning. Um, for some of y'all, something new will be beginning with the fire sign, especially if you're reuniting. So for some of y'all, we'll, um, we'll be meeting a soulmate <laughs> during this time. Some of y'all are reuniting with an earth sign or kind of, some of y'all are pretty much renewing, renewing love possibly with an earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, okay? I feel like you want to work with this person possibly after moving away from some form of a perception, okay? Maybe uh, you were able to step outside of the situation and see it for, um, not for face value, but below the surface, okay? I do see some of y'all are going, coming out of cycles and going into new cycles, okay? So if you've been dealing with a situation where, the, where this person offered you nothing but a third party situation, you left this person, now they're going to be wanting to come back and fix it in a way that, fix it in a way that actually is going to help both of you to learn from it, grow from it, as well as shed a little bit of experience on your path, okay? And you're understanding, you're going to understand through those downloads why this had to happen, all right? So 
So, Spirit, please clarify for me. Too many. Four of cups. Some of y'all, <clears throat> some of y'all, after moving away from a third party, okay, some of y'all going to be the water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. For some of y'all, this is a twin flame for y'all. Um, strong emphasis on the Pisces. Yeah, for some of y'all, you went into a middle state after the damn tower fell. Okay, so in the past, I do see the tower just recently fell. For some of y'all, all hell have broken loose. Or possibly this new moon with that download that some of y'all got. And it actually revealed some, some three-party shit to somebody. I do see that. Okay. Between the 16th and the 31st, I do see... Yeah, somebody actually in the midst of looking for something or possibly stalking somebody, you're going to find out that you were in a three-party situation, okay, which is going to, and this is somebody, this person was being defensive or maybe you're being defensive towards this person now that they want to work on it, okay, but you're moving on, you're focusing on your money, you're just going to focus on yourself, whomever I'm talking to, and this definitely was somebody who was dealing with an air sign or earth sign, uh, Capricorn towards Virgo or Gemini Libra Aquarius. I do see some of y'all, um, some of y'all don't know if you want to. You've been putting in hard work at your job. For some of y'all, you're going to be getting a promotion very soon during this time, during the 16th to the 31st. Ooh, so many fail. Please clarify the Ace of Cups. Clarify the Ace of Cups. Yeah. Some of y'all, they go to Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Yeah, some of y'all are going into a new union, okay? This person, a lot of y'all is a twin flame. Some of y'all will have to choose from a twin flame. So maybe during this time, some of y'all could have also met another Gemini, and I feel like you're kind of indecisive about it because you were already possibly moving away from an air sign and just boom, he go this other air sign. And I do see that this person is a soulmate to you. Spirit, please show me why the Ace of Wands is here. Yeah, some of y'all, there's a fire sign coming forth. Airy, I mean, Airy Leo Sag. You love this person. You want to begin something new with this person, but this person can be a handful. Whoever this is, this person makes you feel burdened, okay? I do feel like a lot of y'all may have moved away from this person and you was really in your head. You didn't, I see that you didn't show this person. You didn't let this person see you sweat, but you're really missing your boo. Some of y'all going to let them back in and reunite, but they're coming back with that same burdensome shit. Not all of them. Some of them are, though, okay? Communication definitely needs to be had. Um, some of y'all have a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This person in the past possibly did not, there wasn't an equal level of reciprocity, okay? But this person is wanting to come over and they wanted to start over. For some of y'all, this person, um, it could be somebody who you have children with, okay? But I feel like somebody feels like they give more than the other person does and they're tired of that shit. Okay, why is the fourth one? Yeah, some of y'all want to materialize uh, or trying to manifest, okay, reuniting with someone, okay, possibly an earth sign or a fire sign, y'all, and you're going to you gonna get what you want. Your manifestations, watch your thoughts during this time. Yeah, some of y'all are definitely moving away from an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, okay? I feel like for some of y'all, it's a financial issue why you have to move away from this air sign. Some of y'all have a fire sign, Aries, Leo, sad, strong emphasis on the Leo coming in to give you a half ass offer. This person is a soulmate, but you know that even if I put the work in, okay, this story with fire is crazy because I see some of y'all moving away from fire. I see some of y'all welcoming in new fire, Aries, Leo, Sag. And I see some of y'all who have a fire sign that's half ass with y'all and you working with this person because this person is a soulmate to you and you love this person, Dirty Draws. Some of you have a, <clears throat> some of you uh, met someone in the month of June. Maybe this person moved away and didn't give you any explanation. This person is coming back talking during this time. And I feel like intuitively you already knew it had something to do with the mother of a child or some type of mothering issue. But now this person is coming back and wanting to put the work in. Some of y'all have an Aries that you have a family with. You move, you, you're taking a leap of faith and going back and forth. I mean, going back towards your Aries, okay, because you feel like you can't live without this person. You love this person. And some of y'all are going into new cycles with fire signs. So if you had a beautiful cycle during with a fire sign during this time when the mask are being shed, some of y'all are really kind of, see, I really don't like you. You really are at all because you ain't shit. I mean, if you you really starting to get your eye hot moments, okay? <clears throat> some of y'all have an earth sign, Capricorn towards Virgo that's juggling. It could also be a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio that you've been dealing with that's juggling you, okay? Some of y'all going to move away from this person and find another water sign who is your twin flame. Um, some of y'all are going to be cutting off of uh, Y'all, some of y'all definitely cutting off the air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius getting cut off. And some of y'all are 
cutting off somebody who juggles. Strong emphasis on a Scorpio. A lot of y'all are going through trans, uh, transformation. Some of y'all have situations with people who you have kids with that's trying to resurrect. And some of y'all going to blow the whistle on that shit and move away. Some of y'all are going to move forward, okay? And for those of you who are moving forward with the water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, y'all, you can have this new beginning, okay? If you just communicate. I think you have a bunch of options. I really think you do, but I also know that you're my soulmate. So I stay internally fighting myself about giving you this major commitment, marriage, just this this commitment that you want. I want to give it to you. I truly do because I think you bring me balance. I'm passionate about you and I want to start over. Get out of this indecisive mode. Okay? Make a decision, Gemini. Make a decision because you're definitely dealing with a twin or a soulmate and some of y'all are going to move away from a twin to a soulmate. Some of y'all are going to move away from a soulmate to a twin. It's up to you, okay? This is what I have for you during <clears throat> during um this mid-month of August. Y'all, my throat chakra. Y'all, planet Mercury is on my ass. It does not like mocha. M&M does not go together right now. But um, this is what I have for you guys during the 16th to the 31st of August. I love you very, very, very much, my babies. Remember, stay centered because change is coming, okay? And for some of y'all, it's a balanced change. You're not going to like it, but you're going to appreciate it and understand it soon enough okay definitely do not allow them downloads to scare y'all because it is coming whatever those of you who are starting school again congratulations my baby keep pushing knowledge is power i love y'all very much until september deuces booze